and bonnet. Her, well, you don't have to rip your tongue out. Here's a question from BravoTV.com on Twitter. <laughs> Constant tardiness is a sign that you think your little world is more important than everyone else's. What's your deal? My deal is I have two kids, and they come first all the time. And I the have... Halloween party, the Halloween party is a, it was a, is a really, it's a very funny scene because... Jill Zara knows I'm going to be late. Oh, hold I'm gonna be on. Late. No, no, no. Oh, yeah. Get and I my show phone. Up on time. Hold on, Kelly. Jill I'm, Zarin, I'm all about the truth. You, knew you texted me. You I'm came so at 10 mad. 10 you texted o'clock. both of us. I'm so mad. Now I admit, I admit, you're you're delusional. You're delusional. You're delusional. You went crazy. Okay, okay. Delusional. Kelly, okay. Kelly went crazy. You don't have to high five me. I'm not going to high five and delusion. I'm not a fan. I have the time And you made it on time for the Clunes party that night. You did. Thank you. You're welcome. Do you know where was I last night, by the way? Um. I'm going to go back to my notes. Okay. So I was late. what do you care? We no, all felt what do you, we all felt well, obligated Kelly, to be there. You, no, honestly, why? No, you, no, 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 you never okay, apologized okay, to any of us okay, for being okay. late. You Let's, never apologized. Okay, you know Did you Kelly ever speak. apologize? Okay, Let when? Kelly speak. Honestly, now. Did you apologize to me for being for not showing up? Did you read your own book? I mean, honestly. This Ooh, behavior is appalling. Really? Wow. Seriously. Really? No, it's not appalling. What's it appalling is. is that you don't show up to your own party and you don't even apologize for it. You know, That's I, appalling. Uh, well, I was late friend. and I apologize. That's the first thing I'm I said. Sorry. Do you that is appalling. Would you like to re-roll this? I said I was late. I said everybody no. knew. Taryn no, knew. No, that's Ariel what you said. Knew. You said everyone everybody knew. knew. Nobody knew. That's you what you knew. Don't I texted no, you. No, Jill texted me at 10.45. Excuse me. Jill is at a fabulous party with you. Don't Go to your parties. Don't come to my parties. If you didn't tell me you weren't going to be there. If it's come. such an issue it's to be around issue. me. It's not an issue. She was on time and you told her an no. hour 45 minutes. Oh, this is the issue. Listen, listen, I, I need to show. give you my book is what I really need to do. Okay, thank I you I really so need much. to give you my book. Okay. <laughs> Tell me you're stopping with a Kelly because I can't take it. Okay, thank well, you. maybe let me talk. Yeah, okay, please. We'll I see love what I say. Talk. We'll see what I say. Please. Okay. I love you, Andy. In conclusion, will the two of you ever be friends? Would you ever go to lunch? Can you see any rapprochement? Happening. I have no idea. Honestly, it can't get any worse. I can tell you that. It you cannot sure? get any worse. I mean, if we like get into mud wrestling and like get into Madison Some of my Square Garden, I, I, I mean, I will take you know, it. Can't you 